it's very important having in the boards people that have a diversity of competences and also a competences in IT and not the bits and the bytes but understand how we need to lead a company through this digital transformation. Since I come from a technical background and to go as a professionally in my career, I need to have some management kind of things in my profile and I find the course suited for me. I work in IT for a long time and my knowledge is basically on technical knowledge. I now better understand what I do in order to realize the company goals. So before that was something fluffy, but now this link has become very clear to me. Secondly, my vocabulary has changed. So this enables me to make better contact, to better align myself with people of the business. For example, if I propose a solution to my client, then it's not in technical terms, now it's in business terms. I use what I learn in the day-to-day -day situations, both with my own staff. My staff are IT people, so I can really help them to understand what clients are facing and how their IT solutions can meet business objectives. We started within the course from the strategy, the values of uh, the company. Uh, embedded with the governance model, we need to put in place and then how business and IT need to be aligned. So this is a very interesting topic for board members. So I, I really think that it's very important that a lot of board members would follow uh, such courses uh, for the future of the companies. Today we did a field assignment. First of all, we prepared our work here at the AMS and then we looked and went to a couple of stores where we were looking at how we could enhance their business with, by using digital transformation. Uh, we had uh, several teachers, we had two types of them. We had the professors, and, but we had also external speakers. We had, uh, for example, Bjorn van Reet that came and explained what he did in his career and how he did that and how he did the different steps. Very interesting for, for people um, uh, in IT that want to grow in their career. Um, but it was a diversity of the professors I liked. Also, Stephen has a unique strategy of teaching. He, he relates the thing very tactically. He's also a part of COVID 2019. I would really recommend uh, this MAS program um, for IT people in order to understand business better and to be able to use business vocabulary. You know, I already recommended this study to other people. There is a new student that started, uh, I think, three sessions ago. It's Pascal van Dam, the CEO of Dell, a good friend of me. Uh, and I recommend that to a lot of people because I'm pretty sure that if the board members and in advisory boards people are not um, interested or to have a bit more skills in IT, each time that the CIO is coming in the board with a presentation, they can't follow. And as I said by the start, that all companies are in a transformation mode and in a disruption mode, and that digital transformation is related on that, I think it's important that board members need to have a flavor of what is IT.